the first chase of the game. Wow, that little kid is fast. How did he get up those stairs so fast? Turn on the jets. We don't have time to be going this slow. You got to go faster. Wow, I'm going to lose him. Reduce the distance to target. That's the sentence you don't want to read in this game. Wow. I feel painfully slow. Okay, wait a second. Fine, you little mobsman. Keep it. Well, well. What do we have here? You're on our property. <laughs> These noobs have no idea what they're getting themselves into. Oh, I'm just going to go back and forth. Don't pull out that knife when I'm not looking. Let me take off your hat too. Got both of their hats off. Get comfortable out here. Finish. Finisher. The finisher. Ooh. Oh, that guy was waiting to get finished. <laughs> Excellent. What else does London have to offer? Now is not the time for tourism, Jacob. Now's the time to find Henry Green. I've always Help! been a quicker climber. There's been a murder! Not since we were two. Race you to the highest vantage point. You're going to lose again. Not on my watch. I wish they let me kill that guy. Maybe that's why she wanted to race. Because she knew I was about to kill somebody. Kill that snitch for trying to talk. She knows her brother well. Why is she slowing down? Hey, I ain't mad. This is an optional objective. I've got the lead. She's nowhere in sight. Unless she's got some kind of teleportation ability. Where is Mr. Green's shop located? It was marked on Father's map. Two assassins. Equal in height. One female, one male. Two decades old. And those devilish smiles. You must be the Fry Twins. And you are? Henry Green, at your service. I was sorry to learn about your father's passing. Thank you. What can you tell us about Crawford Starrick? I suppose the council desires news. London must be freed to provide a better future for all of its citizens. Well, thank goodness the council saw reason and sent you to aid us. Yes. Thank goodness. Unfortunately, I am the bearer of bad news. Today, Starrick sits at the helm of the most sophisticated Templar infrastructure known in the Western world. Every class, every borough, the gangs, the industries. His reach extends all across London. I've always thought of myself as a gang leader. Firm, but fair. Huh. Well, I have uniforms. And I'll unite a mix of disenfranchised outsiders under one name. That's it, Evie. We can rally them to our side. Oh, like the way that you rallied those card players at the Oakbrook Tavern into the river. Oh, that was different. They beat me at whist. I can see it now. We'll call ourselves the Rooks. You were never good at chess either. Have you got a better plan? Find the piece of Eden. Oh, well, let me show you the lay of the land. Shall we? The best way to see any landscape is from above. You've got that right. This is Assassin's Creed. It's all about this synchronization, getting a good view of everything they've created, this world. So how do you like this environment? How do you like these graphics? Did they do a good job? Did they do a bad job? So far, I like how the city looks. I mean, look at this. I think they did a pretty good job. Look at what Starrick has done to the city. Whitechapel is riddled with crime. Child labor, despite regulations. A gang known as the Blighters overruns the streets. And Templars manipulating behind the scenes. As in all the other boroughs, we need to return this city to the people who built it in the first place. We will free London from Starrick. You have my word. I'm my looks. Miss Fry, your passion is inspiring. Come. Let us return to my shop, and I can bring you up to date on the rest.
That was a beautiful dive. That was textbook. It's so weird. Seeing three assassins all together in the same game. Wait a second. We got to see this splash. I got to see her flying. Ooh, that was dope. Now look at how long this block is. If you actually walk this entire block, I wonder how long it'll take you to just keep going all the way down like this. Keep quiet. Kalok's looking for me. Who's Kalok? One of Starik's gang leaders. Why does he want you? He's after some of my more arcane research into one of the precursor artifacts. The Peace of Eden. So tell me about these blighters. In search of an army, Starik gathered up the nastiest of the underworld. Some of the city's gangs tried to prevent it and were slaughtered for their efforts. Now, only Whitechapel's clinkers remain opposed, but they're no match for the blighters. Well, let's shine these clinkers up then, shall we? They're just the sort we're looking for. You can't be serious. Evie, they're ready to fight and oppose the blighters. This is my chance to step in. Look out, London. Here come the rooks. The rooks, huh? I guess they've done enough talking. And I'm faster than him even though I gotta follow. Confound this city! No one looks where they're going! Yes, I've noticed that. Bloody drood! I'll never finish it at this rate. Only Providence knows where those words are headed now. Well, I must get to work replacing them. Should you ever be in the mood for a tale or two, you can always find me where the ale is warm and tempers are hot. Ta-ta! What an odd man. That Mr. Fry was Charles Dickens. Knows everyone and everything in the city. If I were you, I would keep that connection in your back pocket. <clears throat> Kalok's gang is nearby. They must not follow me back to my shop. We'll take care of it. Yeah. You might be able to use this. Oh god, I hope so. My carriage is nearby. Make use of it to throw them off my trail. I will meet you at the curio shop. Steady on. We need to lead them away from green. We've got some carriage gameplay. Here comes trouble. The carriages are easily damaged. Kalok will rue the day. Come on now, come up on the side so I can ram you. Come up on this left side. Stop playing around. There you go. Get rammed. Oh, I didn't time it right. Let me wait a second. Here we go. I got him that time. Okay, he's done. So I guess I got to go back now to get the other one. The other guy is too slow. Or maybe he's not slow. Maybe he knows. Maybe he's trying to run away. Okay, he is slow. He's coming this way. We're playing a game of chicken. Who's going to bite first? Who's going to bite? Oh, he turned. He wanted that collision. Take that. If you want a collision, I'll give you a collision. <laughs> I wanted to play chicken. I chickened and he didn't chicken. Is this a fake video? He's shooting. They're shooting in London. Take that. Ooh, oh, that's a murder. Aye, aye, Captain. You're relentless. That relentlessness will see me become master when we finish this. George would do nothing of the sort. Whatever's left of the creed would perish under your control. Harsh words, dear sister. I do hope Mr. Green made it back safely. Don't tell me you fancy the bloke already. And what do you suggest we do if our number one source of information turns up dead? Starry can't be that hard to find. I say we turn the carriage round and go find him. This is why you aren't in charge. Keep moving. Easy does it. Let's go. I'm not even gonna lie. I want to get back in that carriage and beast and feast on these noobs like that. Did you give them the slip? We gave them more than that. <laughs> Who are all these people? Over the years, I have established a number of connections across the city. Splendid. We'll need focused aid. Focused aid? <sighs> we take over Starek's gangs, we cripple his control. You're not aiming high enough. Starek has influence in every branch of society. We need to match him. I see what you're saying, Evie. We need the Rooks. You are not starting a gang called the Rooks. I believe I may have an idea of my own. We will need the police to turn a blind eye to activities. My ally in the force, Sergeant Abilene. I've heard he's a master of disguise. Next up, urchins. 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 
Children make for excellent spies. Clara O'Day. Smart as a whip, that one. Finally, you would be wise to remember that Starrick never acts alone. There are gang leaders in every borough. You'll meet them soon enough, no doubt. Rexford Gaylock. Known for his ability to vanish before your very eyes. Should we make him vanish for real? I suppose. One moment. Um, a Templar target you might want to look into. Uh, be cautious. It's rough out there. No, don't worry about me, Greeny. I can handle a few thugs. Sean or Rebecca. I still think attacking a Templar is a mistake. Call Dr. Grammatica. <sighs> Come on. Please, Isabel. What a lovely surprise. Our mutual friends will be here shortly to search for the artifact. Once it's located, I'll let you know. Super. Always a pleasure. Prick. It's people like you that give historians a bad name. I'm afraid I don't have time for you today, Mr. Hastings. Thank you for making my job easy. Oh, shit. It does look grim. Masterberg, Agent Acosta. Deal with them, please. Move it! Hunt them down! All they had to do was wait for you to search the data. Their little stunt has put the whole operation at risk. You need to synchronize Jacob and Evie's memories. Find something that puts us ahead of the enemy. Time is of the essence, and lives are now clearly on the line. Good luck. Now turn around, just turn. No, don't come this way. Why would you come this way? Why would you do that? Why? Ah! <laughs> Those were the two upgrades I got. The double assassination and being able to see through walls. A little more electricity. <laughs> <laughs> 